Welcome back to another daily drawing challenge. Today we are focusing on one of my favorite artists, Gustav Klimt. He painted such things as The Kiss and The Tree of Life. He was known for uh, Art Nouveau and these beautiful decorative pieces that he would lay gold into. Now that you've gotten a chance to see my favorite, one of my favorite pieces of art by one of my favorite artists, let's get drawing. We're gonna start with the ground and just create that illusion of what is the ground and what is the background. So this is in front and this is behind. And then I'm gonna start to create my tree trunk by just pulling upward and again, making the base a little thicker than the trunk itself. Now, the fun that happens with this tree is it is all swirls. So I'm gonna make a swirl here, and then I'm gonna swing around and make the swirl travel the other direction. And I could even add another one right here that's a little smaller. And literally, this is the entire tree is just made out, all of the branches, every bit of this tree is made out of swirls. So you can build your swirls any direction you want. You can make them smaller or bigger. I'm going to extend a few out in different directions to really fill up this top portion. You can make your base swirls first or you can branch them out. Let's just have some fun creating spiral lines to represent a tree. And if you have smaller spaces you want to fill in, you can do little swirls, put a little swirl right there. If you've got an extra branch that you want to extend out further, you could put a curved line followed by a swirl, tucking that through. Really simple, fun way to honor my favorite artist by creating what I like as the tree of life. The tree of life is represented in lots of different cultures and in lots of different ways, but usually it's a tree showing that it's growing out of the ground and producing life. All right, my friends. And then the fun thing that uh, Klimt would always do is adding dots or spots of different colors all throughout. Gold was a big color that he would use a lot in all of his different artworks. We've only got silver graphite today, but if you wanna break out your colors and really show the dynamic thing that is life inside of this tree, I would say the sky's the limit with what colors you can pick and what you choose to do to decorate. Thank you so much for enjoying uh, one of my pieces, favorite pieces of art with me and learning a little bit about the artist. I hope that you tune in next time. Please don't forget to subscribe and like. We'll be doing another drawing challenge tomorrow. Thank you from the bottom of our art.